Hey everybody, it's Dr. Heyer from Holistic Health. I hope you're having a fantastic day. Today is going to be the last video following up in a series we've done over the last three or four weeks relating to headaches. And the reason that we're doing that is, is because there are millions of Americans who suffer needlessly from headaches. Why is that such a big deal? Can't I just pop some pills and I feel better? Well, in many cases, you can. Until it gets to the point where the headache is just ruling and dictating your life and ruining relationships, and in some cases, maybe even losing your jobs because you just can't function like a normal person and do the work. And then of course, well, you know, your employer has things to say about that. I've been practicing for 20 years, 16 years here in Frankfurt, and I've actually kind of lost track of how many people have come to me complaining of their headaches and how many times people have said that they've had suicidal thoughts. In fact, I've literally had people say, that they I had one gentleman tell me how he took two bottles of his wife's sleeping pills, put them on the end table, and was going to take them so that he didn't have to wake up in the morning and deal with this anymore. And that's just one of many other stories that I don't want to even go into. So this last video is going to talk about how can chiropractic help people who have headaches. The interesting thing is, and it depends on which research you're looking at, anywhere from 60 even up to 70% of the time, it's estimated that most headaches have their origin in a cervicogenic origin, or in other words, they have their start in the neck. And why could that be? Well, if we look at this little chart with this lady's spine, if there's any misalignment in the upper cervicals, it has a huge impact on the nervous system. There's a huge amount of neurological input and output that comes in the cervical area and that can oftentimes affect and trigger and cause headaches. And a lot of people don't realize that. I'll give you an example. Just maybe three days ago, four days ago, I had a lady coming in who's been kind of bouncing around for the last nine or 10 months to different doctors, providers, different therapies that aren't really being effective. And just did a quick, simple exam and found very quickly that she had cervical genic discs, she had disc issues, and it was triggering not only pain in her back, her arms, and her body, but also triggering her head. And so some people just don't seem to understand that their head is where they're feeling the symptom, but the neck is actually the underlying cause. And it's not unusual for a patient to come in with an MRI of their brain that their primary or their general practitioner ordered just to rule out bad things like brain tumors. We want to make sure that those aren't the cause. Um, but after that, many times the patient is told the doctor doesn't know what's causing it. And it's just a couple inches below the head, and we need to look at the neck. So if you or somebody you know is suffering from headaches, and is, you're kind of at the end of your rope, and you've been through other things, and you've tried all the medications, consider trying a chiropractic approach. Um, it's safe, it's effective, it's gentle, and in many cases, it's the thing that will help address the underlying cause and get you back to being normal and having a normal life. So if you or somebody you know is suffering from this, feel free to shoot us an email or call us at this number. And if not, at the very least, if you would do us a favor, hit the like button and share with somebody who may be able to benefit from this information. Thanks. Have a great day.